think that a big part of tonight was that you guys were constantly playing catch up. What did you see that was kind of the biggest difference maker? Uh, yeah, I feel the same way. Um, I feel like in some of our coverages, we were playing catch up a bit, and against this team, we got. Um, three elite scores from all angles of the floor. You got to be, uh, you got to do your work early, and you got to just be there on the catch. You know, so I felt like a lot of times we chasing a bit, um, and that was just consistent throughout the whole game. Us just playing from behind, and I think we 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 definitely put our foot on the gas here in spurts and tried to make it a game. I cut it to three, cut it to five a couple times, um, but they made shots. You know, they're, they're talent players, special players. So. Um, when you got your whole five and double figures, it's tough to stop that. Understanding that this team has a couple really talented scorers uh, to kind of play a mid-range game that you know we don't see all the time. Do you feel that some of the defensive problems early in the game, first half, was them just hitting tough shots, or do you think it was a lot of miscommunications, maybe a couple busted things on your guys? Yeah, yeah, just a, a couple busted coverages. Um, when you look at it there, the top two guys, you know, were 12 for 31 um, for it, what, 35 points. You know what I'm saying? We could live with that. Um, but it's Pat Williams made some shots, made some, got some easy rolls to the rim. Io playing, been cramped, playing great this year, put pressure on the rim. Uh, Vooch came out. Uh, he's one of their guys, but, you know, he came out and they, they you know, featured him, threw the ball in the, the, ball to him in the post a lot. So, um they played together as a team tonight. I think we, uh, you know, we 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 made a miss a couple times, but it wasn't consistent enough all game. Uh, you got to give them credit. But we, we kept fighting and put ourselves in position to try to win a basketball game that late. You said, I mean, you guys had it down at three, five a couple times, but you couldn't get to that hurdle to tie it or anything. Yeah. Do you look at any of that as energy exerted to get it to that three or five mark that to maybe prevented you guys from getting – Different time, essentially. I want to call. It, I want to blame it on the energy. I felt like we've been in that position before, and we was able to get over the hump. To be honest, I think our momentum got stopped a few of those times because we put them on a free throw line right after that. You know what I'm saying? We might coming out of the, coming to the fourth quarter. I think Io got some free throws going to the rim that cut our momentum a bit. So when the team can stop the clock and get at the free throw line, when we kind of surging back, that that throws us off a bit. So uh, you gotta give them credit. Once they, once we we swung back, they swung as well, and and. Uh, was able to withstand our runs and and got a good win. Um, I feel like we got some good shots there late too that we uh, we just didn't knock down. We got to the rim, but it was one of those games we just didn't finish. Um, Kevin, this is the first time you guys have lost in a month. I mean, it was, I mean, if you think about it, it's pretty amazing. Yeah. Uh, you know, Boston, December fourth, exactly a month. What do you during that time? What is what do you think you've said to the league about your team having a strength? Or it doesn't matter. What have you yourself? What have you said to yourself? Oh, uh, I, I mean, we just uh, we understand how we want to play every night. Uh, I feel like the league is always on notice with the talent we have on our team. I don't think everybody anybody takes us for granted when they're preparing for us each night. Uh, but I think for us, we we found some things that were good for us on both ends of the floor, and we want to just be consistent with executing those things as we move forward. So it's good to have winning streaks, but we we more concerned with how we plan and what we're doing to produce the wins. And I think uh, we you know we we're, we're walking in the right direction when it comes to that. We're building some solid habits. So um, we got to consistently do that every night, every possession. That's the that's the game. That's the battle. That's what you're really going up against is chasing perfection every time. Um, so looking forward to the next game. Look forward to tomorrow and practice and film and see how we can get better. Kevin, to follow up on that, you had said a few weeks ago during this stretch, you guys found your identity. You know who you are and who you want to be. As you look back on the month, why do you think the rhythm has been as consistent as it's been lately? Uh, for the most part, we got guys in the lineup. Um, we was able to get Joe, TJ back, Seth back in the fold, Ben, Kai. So us being healthy helps. Um, and we we communicating as a as a unit, everybody from the coaches staff to the players. We're trying to figure out the best way for us to play, you know. So when we're watching film, we walking through stuff, we communicating throughout the game. That just helps and makes us more comfortable as time goes on. And and guys individually working on their games when we get you know practice time or we get some shoot around time. Guys are working on their games and coming in the games very confident in what they can do. So um, just gotta keep building.